Hi, my name's Lee, I'm from MGI. Today I'm going to show you how to replace a speed controller on a Zip Series buggy. To replace a speed controller, you will need a Phillips head screwdriver. I'm using a power drill with a Phillips head attachment. In order to replace the speed controller, you'll need to remove four screws from the back plate of the top box. You want to remove the four outer screws and keep the two centre ones in position. Once you've removed all four screws, you can press on the outside of the speed controller and it will pop out of the housing, like so. You'll also notice that there's a ribbon attached to a connection point inside the housing, which you'll need to remove. So with your fingers, you can just pull the ribbon out of place. To reconnect, simply get your new speed controller and connect the ribbon into position and tuck it behind the housing and pop the speed controller back into position. Like so. Connect the four screws. I like to keep the power drill on a low torque setting so that I don't strip the screws. Three and four. Once you've put everything back into position, it's a wise idea to grab your battery and connect to the buggy just to test it to make sure everything's working okay. That's how you replace a speed controller on a Zip Series buggy. If you'd like any more information, please visit our website www.mgigolf.com.